This is the start of the Great Western Trail from Big Mountain. <laughs> oh, thank you. How are you doing? Better than we deserve. <laughs> oh, no, I doubt that. Big Mountain Pass is about 15 miles from Salt Lake City. Here is a parking lot for the trailhead. I make my way up the side of the mountain to the switchbacks. If I remember, there are 10 switchbacks to the saddle. to the top of the switchbacks and there were six, not 10. I thought there were 10, but there were six. So behind me, you can see I reached Aspen's on the other side of the mountain, which would be the north side of this mountain. Anyway, it's a beautiful day today and I'll continue on. Through the trees you can see Big Mountain right there in the center of the screen. And that's where I'm headed. Through the trees, I notice there's snow on the ridge line. I'm quite surprised about that because it is late May. I will walk by there and I will check it out and get back with you on that. We'll continue down the trail. I reach the next saddle and I see the snow strip ahead. I will check that out. tossing snowballs in May. At the top of the hill, the trail smooths out and goes into Aspen's.
I'm making my way towards Big Mountain. And right there, it's like a soft, big mountain. And that's where I'm headed. Uh, this is my favorite tree on this hike. I start my final push to the top of Big Mountain. Trail luck on top. I was going to have lunch on top, but it was so windy. Here is a 360 degree view from Big Mountain. I leave the wind and Big Mountain and head back.